here in Palm Beach County, there was a celebration tonight, a Jewish wedding that almost never happened and almost ended in tragedy. It's quite a story. Aria Heights here with the story of a very improbable wedding celebrated in a very unique and wonderful way. Ari. OK, let me set this up for you. A couple who lives in New York had flown to Israel for their wedding. That's where the bride grew up. That's where her family still lives. But then the war started and what was supposed to be the beginning of their lives together very nearly became the end. At first glance, this may look like just an ordinary Orthodox Jewish wedding in North Palm Beach, but this wedding is anything but ordinary. It's unbelievably heartwarming how Jews, non-Jews, people, just people came together to give this couple an unbelievable experience. The couple, Zalman Roxon and his wife, Daniela. This wedding was supposed to happen in Israel. It was canceled because of the war. Zalman has family here, so he and his fiance came to Palm Beach County. We weren't sure if they were even going to get here. When they finally got here on Thursday, that's when we actually said, hey, let's let's give them a wedding. This is just unbelievable. I mean, from everything we've been through, you know, having to leave Israel and canceling the wedding over there and just uh, making it happen here within a week. The flowers, the music, the catering, it all came together in five days. We decided that these, this couple has to get married because that's how the Jewish people survive. We, we move on, we grow, we rise above. Some of the guests could make it, most could not. Many of the people here are strangers. When you see someone going through something so difficult, you want to be there to support and show love, even if you don't know the person. We wanted to make sure that there are people there that could support them and could boost them up when they're in like a, a sad place. And what makes this even more special? The wedding was supposed to happen at a venue just outside Jerusalem Tuesday night. A rocket fell there at the exact time they were supposed to be getting married. It was crazy. It was like yeah. Hashem is, is with us. It, it broke my heart in a place where we could have been, but God decided we weren't supposed to be there. Thank God we weren't there and we weren't supposed to be there. Instead, they're here celebrating eyes toward a lifetime of happiness. This is the best way for us to, to stay strong, stay in control during these times. The good deed and the mitzvah that we are doing, which is getting married, is the biggest and best mitzvah you can possibly do as a Jewish person. And most of Daniela's family still in Israel, not able to attend this wedding. She says she cannot wait to be able to fly back over there, see them and celebrate with them as a married woman. Oh, we wish them all the best. You can see so much happiness in all that video. So much happiness. And how about the community coming up, stepping forward mm -hmm. for these people that they don't know, they've never met before, but still taking the time out of their day to show up and celebrate with them. Beautiful gesture. That's our yeah. community here Absolutely. in Palm Beach County.